EFNN, The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here. This is the Tiger Financial News Network. 10 a.m. market update, and this is the Thursday edition, the 19th of May. Looking at the Dow down 431,097, took out the left side low that was so important to hold, um, and that was the low of 32,272. This is the leg D, and at the same time, we're looking, monitoring the DOG, which is the one to one short the Dow, and it is in leg D. So it says that right here, under certain conditions, at least an attempt at some kind of a bounce is possible. So we'll talk about that in my show coming up, the Target Technicians Hour. We're looking at the S&P. It's a little different here. S&P has uh, dropped again, but it hasn't taken out the 3858.67 low of uh, six sessions ago. It's at 3900, 3, down 23. Day is very, very young. We've got that H pattern. If you look at the SH, which is one to one short, you've gone to a, um, a high of five, that's also six sessions ago. That was on the 12th of 16.38. This is a one-to-one -one short. The high today so far is 16.26. Uh, we'll see. Is it going to make a leg deed to the upside? The QQQ, one, two, three, hasn't gone below the 284.94 low of the 12th of May. So with all this incredible tension that's going on, suddenly there's a little bit of support that we can find. I don't want to be Pollyannish about this. I'm just saying I'm looking to see whether or not there can be a bounce. Options tomorrow, options expiration if applied materials this afternoon comes out with even moderately positive uh, um, anything to do with their earnings or outlook. That's going to be a big deal. The IWM, the Russell 2000, is also holding above the 168.90 low of uh, the other day. It's at 176.17. Now, gold is rallying. Gold is rallying because it is up 23 right now at 1839. Since the dollar, we've been discussing this for a few days, has probably made a peak F in the Chapman wave at 105.01, and now it's ready to go back into that rectangle formation. Crude oil just doesn't let go. It is, crude oil is uh, down $1.24 at 105.81, still within that rectangle formation, and the TLT is actually rallying very nicely up $1.22. I'll be back. We'll talk about all these different aspects when I get back to the Tiger Fish Up. Check out opening call daily news. Be back in a moment. Hope you can stay. Otherwise, have a great day. And I'll see you.